shops on all of these all of these streets. The intersection is kind of the center where all they meet and kind of spread out from here. So there's restaurants, bars, clubs, everything in all the surrounding area. And it's definitely a good place for young people or like I said, anybody who's just wants something a little different for their neighborhood. And um, we're gonna take a walk down here to um, Jay's Beef, it's one of the better known Italian beef places in the city. So come on, look at that. Clear definitions of where the neighborhood started to begin and kind of up in the air. I guess traditionally they all kind of cover the area between Western and Ashland, Armitage, and Chicago. Maybe from Chicago to Division would be called Ukrainian Village. From Division to North would be Wicker Park. And then from North up to Armitage would be Bucktown. I guess it's an easy way to do it, but for the most part, Winter Park and Bucktown are kind of interchangeable labels for this same, you know, stretch of neighborhood here between those coordinates of North, Chicago, Western, and Ashland. So this is one of the best Italian beef places in the town. It's Jay's Beef, and it's definitely a highlight of the neighborhood. We're gonna go inside and have some sandwiches and see how the how the pros make them. Let's go. Hey guys, what's up? I'm back here with Jay's Beef. Um, it's Tony, the owner. Say hi, Tony. Um, today, they're going to show us how to make one of the classic Chicago delicacies, the Italian beef sandwich. And it better be pretty good because Philly, they love my cheesesteaks. The best double dogs in Chicago by far. Thanks. You're in here. I was born and raised in Philly and I love cheesesteaks, but I've been told this is similar, so. We've been here four years. Montrose and Narragansett since the original since 76. Here we are, Chicago. Let's go take a closer look at the uh, beef section. Camera nice and juicy. Alright, let me give you a little demonstration. So, uh, what's in there? Looks like uh, some, some liquid. A piece of French bread. Where'd you guys get your bread from? Canola. Canola baking. Yeah, is that a good bakery? Yeah, we've been with them for years. So, this is where the beef sits, soaks in the gravy, gathers all the seasoning. Double dog time. So, I'm gonna give you a little demonstration on how the sandwich is made. So, we'll go to this pan right here. Let, wow. the, let the gravy run off for a second. Look at that heaping portion. That's it. Put a little sweet peppers on there. And then we'll add a little homemade jardinier. Oh wow. It's hot jardinier. That looks good. Put a, spoon, put a spoonful of that on there. And there's a the beef. A little sweet, a little hot. A little juice. Wrap it up. How long does the beef sit in the gravy for? I mean, the gravy's real hot. The beef's already cooked. So you cook the beef in the morning? We cook it ourselves from scratch. Just take the beef, get big pieces of beef, cook them in the oven, season up, let it cool down, slice it up. Um, so Where do you get the beef process. from? I'll get it from uh, beef processing. So you get like right? a big slab and yeah, you just like get slice it up? cook them, slice them ourselves, and then, uh, so the beef's already cooked, so when we put it in the gravy. So is the gravy like a secret family recipe uh, yeah, or something? Definitely, uh, top secret information. Oh, wow. 
can't say that I've had many Italian beef, but it's definitely the best I've ever had. Oh man. We're gonna have to cut this because I need to keep eating this bad boy. Turn the camera off, man. I'm trying to eat. Clear. I'm just enjoying my tasty Italian beef here from Jay's on North Avenue. I have to say, this is one of the best Italian beef I've ever had. Look at this dripping. Oh, really? These guys definitely know what they're doing. And if I recall, they have locations all over the city. <clears throat> There's this one right here in the Wicker Park, Bucktown area. There's one on Irving Park Road in Illinois. There's one on Narragansett in Harwood Heights, Illinois. So they're all over the north side of town and they make a damn good Italian beef. Let's try these fries out too. It is kind of hard to mess up fries, but it's pretty damn good. You guys got a website or anything? Yeah, we do. Jaysbeef.com. How do you spell that? J A Y S B E E F. Dot. Jaysbeef.com. That's it. Alright. Thanks for coming by. We're open Monday through Saturday, 11 to 11. We deliver Monday through Friday after 5 p.m. And uh, go to our website, jaysbeef.com. Or Grubhub. We're closed on Sundays. Thanks for stopping by. And I'm set for the next two, three meals. And that's so good. He's gonna go take a nice nap. Yeah, man. Yeah, I'm gonna take care of that cut. Yeah, thanks a lot, guys. Alright.